Um, is my room ready, please? My name is James. Oh, okay. Let me check. Mr. James Ansa. That's right. Okay. okay. Please sign here. And this is a room number, C34. All right. Can you let somebody get my bag, please? Oh, okay. All right, thank you. Can I take it there? No, please, thank you. Travel back in town, man. Well, oh, have a seat. All right, let's chat. James James. Yeah, man. Wow. It's been like 10 years. Yeah. How is Tony and everybody? Oh, everybody's doing great, but guess what? They can't wait for this weekend. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'll be going to Cameroon for a couple of days, so I'll join you guys at the resort. Oh, all right, sure. So long as you can make it back in time for the reunion. Yep. But I have a parcel for you. Oh, really? I see what's My brother. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. James. If she opens any wider, she might tear. Is that the name from the movie? Yes. <laughs> oh. 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 Hi. All right. Are you done with work? What? Is this how the ladies open their legs for you every single day? Babe, come on, it's just exercise. Anyways, why are the guys, though? I mean, there's always women exercising with you. I don't know, women need to burn more fat. Why are you asking me this? This is why I don't like you coming to my place of work, because you always start something. You're seeing it like you're hiding something here. Clearly, I don't have anything to hide. But then if you're walking on me in some kind of compromising position, you start to misinterpret stuff. That's not possible. Really? Imagine I walks in on you and then you're kissing some guy in a scene and then I say you're cheating on me. How are you gonna feel? Oh, please. I mean, that's different. How is it different? Tony, look, I didn't come here to fight you. Okay, then why did you start one, babe? You're right. I'm sorry. We were supposed to have lunch together. Today? And yeah, you forgot. Babe, I'm sorry, okay? You know what? It's fine. I didn't come here to make you feel guilty. And just remember that you and I are so engrossed with work that this was the one time, Tony, one time we set aside to have lunch. And you somehow forgot. But hey, no wahala. Come on, babe. I didn't forget intentionally now. Come on. Who said you did? Look, look, listen. I'm going to make it up to you at the resort, okay, this weekend. Just you and me. No work, no... Girls, no whiteness, nothing. Babe. Oh, babe. Linda. Hi. Yeah, keep going. That's it. Three more sets for you. Three more sets for you. Okay? <laughs> I got this. Oh. No, I'm not no, 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 that's how they play. No! Okay. No! No, you don't touch me. 
Don't <laughs> No! <laughs> She can't peck you. She can't do that. Listen, everybody calm down. Okay? It was just a harmless thing. Hey. Ivy. Sorry. Ivy. No, they won't. But I thought I told you not to bring him. That's your boyfriend. Make you know my name. And so this is business. No, this is armed robbery. Benita, give him a chance. This is a bad idea. I mean, he may have been successful in conning a lot of others, but this is a totally different territory. He'll be fine. Let's move. I know, it's good to hear from you. Where have you been? Oh, you're in town. You want to get your hair and nails done? Oh, I'm, so, I'm so sorry, babes. I no longer have a salon. Okay, okay, that's fine. Okay, bye. Three days feels like forever. I know I miss you so much, baby. And for me, it's so difficult for me to be in this big house all alone. I have nothing to do, baby. Baby, I've always told you, give me something to do. I need my salon back, baby. Okay. Enough of that. How was your trip? It was fine. I met up with my old friend James. Oh, James, the one who lives abroad. That's right. The one we're actually going to go see this weekend. Oh, But yeah. enough about that. You know, you've been talking about how you've been bored and sitting at home and doing nothing. I've got something for you. You don't mean it. Yes, I do. Oh, baby. But first off, take a seat and close your eyes. Let's go. Come on. Watch out. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> stay right there. Oh, baby, you're just full of surprises. <sighs> Close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes. What? Oh my gosh! You don't like it? You can actually get a toy for it, throw it against the wall, it'll fetch it for you. Really? Sly, I asked for a salon. Although, so you don't like it? Although, you can give it a name, and when you call it, it'll respond, like, Gaia. Gaia. See? But he just said something. Say what? Ivy, I'm sorry for what happened earlier. What exactly are you sorry for? Do not touch me. I'm not even allowed to hug you anymore. Are you hungry? No, I just want to apologize. What 
What exactly are you sorry for, Ricky? Was that you let a random girl kiss you or peck you? Was that you couldn't defend me in front of those girls when I needed you to? What exactly are you sorry for? Because one sorry can cover all that. It was just a harmless peck. Oh, really? Okay, I couldn't help it. It was not about the peck, Ricky Wallen Mensa. It's about the fact that you reduced me to a mere photographer and you made it seem like it was out of place when I came at those girls. Okay, we've been down this road before. The public ruined my relationships. Come on. I don't want the public to ruin this. I want this one to last forever. That is why I'm keeping it private. Nothing will last forever if I keep getting disrespected like this. Ivy, wait. Ivy. It's gonna be a long weekend. But why are you defying me for these rich people parties, Seth? Charlie, Jerry, the invitation is for two. But why you no carry Benita? No be your girl. Charlie, she my baby, but some places they Charlie. What to me find him call? Why? All my old friends they come with them, my girlfriends. Then me I go appear for there with my partner in crime. Ah, Abba. And so, would they pursue you? So, um, you're going to this party, especially to pick a date, right? Yeah. And how do you intend to date five girls in one night? See, eh? I get to plan. So what are we ordering? Ordering? Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, wait a minute, okay? First, tell me about yourself. Okay, fine. Um, I just finished writing my exams. Eh? Exams? Yeah. Um, oh, wait. Which class are you? SS3. Eh? Uh, thank you for coming. So this guy asked him, if you do want me to come, why do you even invite me in the first place? Imagine, who, who invites someone to a date and tell the person, <laughs> Don't tell us to put it on his bro. Yeah, no. I don't know. See, the skin is nice though. You'll be coming here also. Hi. Hi. Hello. <laughs> you brought all these girls? Yeah. I mean, these are my friends and I never go anywhere without them. Yeah. I hope you don't have any problem with that. No. You can go home with them then. Thank you for coming. God bless you. Really? So are you done stressing yourself? Oh, I'm not afraid, Mr. But I'm here and you never asked me. It's not like you want to go for an event like that. All right. Would you like to go? Oh, leave me alone. Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure? Okay, I'll go. Are you sure? Okay, I'll go. You go. I'll go. Here you go. I'll go. So you look good. You're looking dope. Thanks, man. Um, anyways, I um, meet my friend, Ivy. Oh, hi, Ivy. 
Hi, hi, hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, look at this two men. Toby! What's up, bro? <laughs> What's going on, Ricky? Good, bro. Beast. Good to see you. Good to see you, man. What's up? Ricky! Linda! What are you doing here? <laughs> oh! Yeah, I forgot you guys know each other from the movies. Yeah. Yes, we are like in every movie together. Really? Yes. I don't watch a movie, sorry. Just look at that. Yeah. Really? <laughs> You're missing out. Oh, you're right. <laughs> wow, so good to see you. Such a small world. But you didn't tell me you were dating my friend. Well, I did say I was dating a gym instructor named Tony. But there are a lot of gym instructors named Tony. Hey, 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 hey <laughs> but I'm, I'm the best one, yeah? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good to see you. Yeah. Um, sorry, I'm, where my man is? Linda, meet Ivy, my friend. Hi. Oh. Hi, Ivy. Hi. Hi, Hi. how, how are you? Are you? <laughs> Same here. Hi. Tony, Tony. Ivy. Yeah. Yeah. She Hi, may not swan all over you because she doesn't watch movies either. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> See, make sure everything is intact when we leave. I beg. I'm sure those people also still one way or another. Benita, from today to when we leave, your name is Peace and you're a teacher. Peace. Why peace? Have you seen anyone named Peace that causes trouble? No. Listen. Your name is Peace. Deal. No. Deal. Fine. Smile. How do we get to meet people that don't see our work? Oh, <laughs> opposites attract, right? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Go. Hey. Hey. Ray Ray! Yo, where have you been? I've been around though. Hey, you're looking amazing. Charlie. Hey, Charlie, you guys are looking sweet. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Thanks. You're looking dope. Thanks, bro. But who is this lovely lady? My name is Benita, and I work in a hotel, strip club, or bank. Basically, anywhere there's money. Oh. 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 Hi, Tony. I'm a gym instructor. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I like this guy. No, of course you do. It's like, nice to meet you. Three months. Hey, Linda. Hey. <clears throat> you guys should get your own keys. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey. Hey. <laughs> After yeah. you, my princess. Please, I don't want to this guy. Please, I don't want to you. Huh? <laughs> hey. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, I'm standing just opposite the arrival. Um, in front of a container office, sort of. Yes. Green. Hello? Yeah. Are you James? Yeah. I'm your car driver. No, this is not the car I ordered. Oh. Are you not James? No, I'm sorry. I, I ordered a saloon car. This is not a... It's not, it's not, it's not in a car. <laughs> oh, why? the body of the cow. Eh? It's the engine that matters. I can take you wherever you're going. This is not the car I ordered. Uh, I understand. Eh? But there's heavy traffic in town, so there are no cars around. Unless you want to wait. You will wait, sir. Hmm? Or do you want to wait? Otherwise, I'm your last option. Do you have AC? AC? Follow me. Are we safe? Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, I think. I'm, I'm coming. Hello? 
Hey, Sandra, how are you? Yeah, I'm in Ghana. Oh, you're in Spain? Oh, right, yeah, that's how come the thing was ringing different. Oh, okay, okay, so when I come back? Right, okay, all right, all right, then I'll be in touch. Okay, all right, bye. <sighs> Hello? Hi, can I speak? Yes, my name is James. Oh, okay, okay, all right. Hi, how are you? Yeah, that was your husband. How is everything? Yes, I'm back in town now. Oh, you just had a baby. Oh, congrats. Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, okay, fine. Then I'll just be in touch then. <laughs> All right, congratulations once again. <sighs> okay, bye. <sighs> Hello? Yes, I'm back in town. Yes, I'm having this reunion and I would want you to be there. Definitely. What? Oh, you call? Okay, okay, all right, no problem. All right, okay, bye. Sir, are you going for a wedding? Is the guard done? Almost, almost. Sir James, don't worry, we'll go right now, eh? Do you need any help? Let me check, maybe it's the water. Ah, oh, it's kind. It's the water. Let me get water. Mm -hmm. Sir James, you say you're going for a wedding? No, I'm actually going for a reunion. I mean, I haven't been back here in 10 years and I want to see my friends, so I'm organizing a reunion at the resort. Yes. Hey. But what would you be doing out of the country for that long, if you don't mind me asking? I'm actually an engineer in Dubai. Dubai? Wow, nice. So, is Dubai far from here? It's not that far if you use first class. First class. <laughs> I get the joke. <laughs> and you, what about you? Um, how did you get into this? Um, well, um, after my parents died, I was left with the responsibility of taking care of my siblings in a country with no jobs. So, yeah. Okay, good. It's okay now? I think so. Um, can you please pack the car for me? Hmm? Oh, no, no, don't worry, don't worry, I'll wait. Please check me. The car was Good, let's go. I go take you there. It's no big chaka chaka. I swear that I will take you there. No big chaka chaka. I see that I can take you there. It's no big chaka chaka. I swear that I can take you there. No shaking. You enjoyed your ride. Yes, I did. Uh, thank you so much for everything that you've done. What's your name? Annie. Annie. Um, I just want to say thank you so much um, for all the help, and um, at this point, I'm okay. Uh, let me get to your bags. For no, you. no, no, it's fine. I, um, I'll call somebody from the inside to, to, to come and help. Uh -huh. Say. Uh... Okay, say, um, if you want some company. I can get you some people. Excuse me? Stop looking left and right. We are the only people here. Uh, if you want, uh, Ashawo. I can arrange some for you. Excuse me? Ashiwo. Ashawo. Sorry? Ashawo. You said Ashiwo. The proper nomenclature is Ashawo. Nomenclature? Wow. Somebody like you uses such a word? The fact that I drive a taxi does not mean that I am not educated. You're talking to a degree holder, sir. All right, look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for saying things like that. I didn't, I didn't mean it that way. But um, I must say that I'm grateful for everything that you've done. But I don't need any ashau. I'm okay, all right? 
Thank you so much. Uh, one more thing. Uh, sir, I can drive you to where you're going tomorrow. I'm sorry, I just need to charge my phone and then I can order an Uber tomorrow. Oh, is it because of my car? Tomorrow they'll bring a fresh car, a proper car, trust me. No, don't worry, truth be told, this car is, is amazing. It, it's, it's been an experience for me, but I'm fine. I'm okay. <laughs> I knew that got to you. Of course it did. Baby, I thought we agreed that we are not ready to go public. First off, you spoke, I never agreed. And even if I did, this is the gathering of friends, not public. It's different. Baby, I don't want to have this fight. Okay, this weekend is all about having fun and catching up with friends. Yeah, you're right. It's about catching up with friends. Exactly. Apparently, that's what you and I are too. Friends. Hello? Hello, this, are you Mr. James? Yeah. Uh, I'm the one. Okay, uh, there's a lady down here. She said okay. uh, she has brought your food. All right, over this one. <laughs> okay, sir. Hi, what's going on here? I brought you your girls. Yeah, but I asked for food, not this. My brother, this is better than food. I've told you that I am not interested. I said no. But sometimes no can mean yes. My no is my no and my yes is my yes. Oh, and I've already promised them fun. You said you wanted a girl to go with you to your retreat. Yes, I said I wanted a girl. I didn't say I wanted a prostitute. So whom do you want to go with? Why are you so interested? Because if I can get you somebody, that means I get my cuts and that's business. Fine. Find me a girl, a classy girl, not these prostitute kind of girls. And I'll get you a cut. All right, consider it done. Somebody who can escort me to the reunion and I'll pay the person 10,000 Ghana cities. 10,000 Ghana? Yes, 10,000 Ghana cities. All the person has to do is to pretend to be my girlfriend or at least convince my friends that she's my girlfriend. 10,000 Ghana? That's a lot of money for just talking to your friends. What if... No, there's no what if. No strings attached. Nothing is going to happen. All right. I see. Wait, wait, come, come, come. Let me get you part payment. So you're really serious about this 10,000? I said seven. But it's seven. Seven or one. Where's the girl? She's inside. Ah. But I you. Let me hurry up and go and meet her so that you won't be late, okay? Come on, come on. Yo, the man himself. James, James. What's up, man? Why are you? Okay. I can't wait to see you, man. It's been a while. Um, I have a bet with Tony that you're having a broad belly by now. You know, I know you've invested in your belly. Oh, you think so? I'm sure winning that bet. <laughs> Can't wait to see you, man. Love you both. <laughs> okay. Why aren't you going for breakfast? I'm not in the mood. 
Oh, Ricky, don't do that. Don't make it seem like every time I open my mouth, I'm draining you. Don't. I didn't say that. I just wanted to know what I did wrong this time. Oh, so you want to know what you've done, huh? Let me tell you. Ricky, you can't keep introducing me to people as your companion. What does it matter? You said they already know we are dating. No, they don't know. Because I was having a conversation with Irene and she thought I was an escort you brought here. Ivy, I'm sorry. You keep saying you're sorry, but sorry won't fix it. Ivy, all my past relationships have been ruined because of publicity. Uh, don't even start. Don't even go there. I have to start. Because it seems you've forgotten why we chose to stay low in the first place. See, Ricky, those relationships were ruined because of what your girlfriends did. Not because it was public. A fan called your attention to the fact that your girlfriend was cheating on you with your best friend. It wasn't the fan's fault. It was not the public's fault. You posted a picture of your second girlfriend who turns out to be someone else's wife. Hey! Again, not the fan's fault. Not the public's fault. Now you posted a picture of your last girlfriend and someone pointed her out to be a porn star. Uh-uh. <laughs> it seems to me that the problem was with your girlfriends and their secrets and not the fans. Ricky, I do not have any secrets. Do you have a secret? I'm asking you, do you have a secret? No. So what then are we hiding? You have to be doing this all the time. Baby, who is it? Who was uh, Mr. Interview? Someone I had an interview with. An interview for? For a job, of course. Odo, talk to me. I've talked to you already. I told you I want to get back to work. And did I allow you to? Allow me? You know what I mean. No. Explain to me what you mean or how it is in your place to allow me to get back to work. Why are you talking as if this is a bad thing, eh? You know I do not want you to suffer. Well, I'm tired of not suffering. One second, excuse me. Hello, Mr. Simon. Yes, yes, I'm expecting your call. on the pickpocketing. Pickpocketing? Yes. The stealing. You seem to be stealing everything inside. Why the sudden self-righteousness? You never cared about what I did, so why now? Well, I didn't expect you to rob the whole place. Hmm? Why can't you control yourself for once? Oh, so you've been with these people for just five minutes and now you think you're one of them? Don't be fooled, though. You know smoking is bad for your health, right? Oh, doctor. And stealing is good for yours, right? Actually, it is. Okay, so we're gonna do the push-ups now, okay? You need to have your hands under your shoulder, directly under your shoulder, okay? So, you go like this, I'll do it with you, all right? Let's go. One, and two, and three, and four. Let's go, again. One, and two, and three. What's going and on? And four. One, and two. Are you freaking serious, Tony? Yeah, okay, just yeah, keep going. Keep going. Hey! Hey, babe, come on now. What? Linda, come on. Oh, come on. last night wasn't enough for you. You need more girls. I was working. Tony, 
you will exercise when we go home, okay? This place is for you and I, not one of your numerous girlfriends. Can I get my phone back, please? <sighs> Come collect it in the bathroom. Linda! Did I meet up to your expectations? <laughs> you're crazy, <laughs> but you're beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> hey, the Jameson. Honorable. Uh, uh, what's up, G? Good to see you, bro. How you doing, man? Not bad, not bad, not bad. How you doing? <laughs> <I'm doing that. laughs> Hey! <laughs> How are you? Oh. <laughs> no, yeah, I thought I was going to make it. Can you imagine? No bad, no bad. <laughs> hey. Hi. How's it? You're on Rampo. Man Jay. Hello, everyone. Um, I'd like you all to meet my girlfriend, Annie. Oh, hey. oh hi. 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 You look very nice. Well, James, I didn't know you were coming with someone. <laughs> well, it was last minute plans. I didn't know I was going to be around this weekend. Oh, OK. Oh. What'd you do? Please let her sit down first. And yeah, yeah, Tony. I mean, let her sit down. <clears throat> Yeah, because she might own like an oil company, you know James. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm actually uh, an air hostess with Emirates. I met James on my flight. Ooh. Hey, Ooh. James the honorable. Wow. <laughs> Can't <laughs> <in> the air. <laughs> Birds I be one ten. <laughs> well, um, it's nice to meet you. Same here. Hi. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Hello, air hostess. Hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, let's eat. Yeah, I'm hungry. All right, what I want to put Where is that girl that came with Raymond? Good to think she's not here with us. But how long have you known her for? Well, we barely know her, but she's the only one that has been acting weird. I agree. Anyway, Ivy, for how long have you and Ricky been dating? Because I didn't even know you two were a thing. Um, we're just friends. How big? <laughs> friends. And why are you hiding it? I'm not lying. We're just friends. Oh, yeah. Annie, where did you and James meet again? And don't give me that story you gave earlier. Ah, what makes you think I'm lying? Sweetheart, I'm an actress. I know bad acting when I see one. I'm not lying. That's how I met him. Yeah, right. Since everybody wants to lie, let me tend to one honest person in this room. Irene, so how long have you and Sly been married? Two years. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys, I really, really miss this time with the boys. <laughs> you know, I can still remember the last time we had something like this. Okay, you remember the guy that chants on James? You know, I'm really proud of myself. I wasn't involved in that fight. You know why? Why? Because I have dignity. Oh, oh, shut up, Mr. Dignity. Nah. What best dignity? Mm. <laughs> good old times, good old times. But those are good times. Unfortunately, I didn't want to cause any problems with your spouses. I just wanted this to be an all boys event. Oh, you tell us. Huh? Oh, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Ah, sorry. Mm -hmm. Why are you okay? Shall let me ask a day how they think oh. What's the issue? My wife. She wants to go back to work. What's the issue? Raymond, what's the issue? Have you seen my wife? Have you seen how beautiful she is? I don't want her to suffer. Whoa, 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 Sly. It is not suffering if she actually enjoys working. Let her work. Yeah, we shouldn't be telling you this. Come on, let her work. Ah. You. You, you, and you. Which one of you is married? Let me think about it. Is this serious? It's not Sly. Barbara, I beg. Can I have more drinks, please? <laughs> Uh, where are you going carrying all this load? Please, it's for the party. Party? What party? A uh, party tonight with the models by the poolside, please. Hey, hey, wait, wait, wait. With the models! Uh, oh, you didn't know about it? No. Sorry, it's kind of late, though, but uh, you are all invited. Another party. Eh? Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean, another party? Well, it wasn't exactly a party last night. It was more like a fashion show. You got invited to a fashion show? Yes, yeah. and we are about to go for another party. Raymond, no. Why? Ah, but we were complaining that we didn't have time to hang up. Okay, this is a sign that we ditch the women and then we go for the party. Oh, yeah? Count me in. Mmm. Me, I know they go. I have a meeting tonight. Oh, <laughs> what do you mean you have a meeting? Yes, I have to meet someone who's going to help me get a shop for Irene. She's my wife. I need to make her happy. Oh, so beautiful. So romantic. It's like, you go figo. But as for us, dear, we did it. So where should we tell them we are going? That's true. What kind of lie can I tell a girl like Linda? Ah, that's like a romantic. <laughs> 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 Are you serious? Yeah, yeah. Aw. Poor Sly. Yeah, he'll be fine, you know, he's a he's a big man. He'll he'll be he'll be he'll be, be alright. So so I'll I'll call you when I get there, okay? Okay, honey. Is it going to be okay? Um, honey, we can only hope so. Um, honey, see you later. Take care. Bye, baby. Aren't you overdressing? It's just a hospital. Well, we don't know how long we're going to be there for. So we might as well look our best. Where are you? He's already in town. Our ah, plans have changed then. No, no, no. Hello, Sly. Okay, here's the story. You were sick and we took you to the hospital, okay? Yeah. Because what happens right now is when you're coming back, you call us and then we'll all come back together. Okay. All right. Okay. Cool. Bye. But okay. where is he even going? Ah, I'm sure he's going to meet up with someone uh, for the opening of his wife's salon. But hey, whatever, whatever. We are going to party with the bottom. We are going to party with the bottom. to take a slide to the hospital, so I was wondering if I could come and join you. Okay, sure, no problem, come in. Uh, 
care for the others to join us. Oh, splendid. Great. Okay. Okay. Hey, Ivy. Uh, Annie's here with me. Can you guys join us? Okay. No, sure, that's fine. I mean, you can come then. So, babes, this is the moment we've been waiting for. There's a pool party tonight, and we cannot miss out! What? No! <laughs> no! Oh my god, that sounds like fun! Oh yeah! Of course does that sound like fun! But the guys must never know about this. Mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> Fire in the distance, lighting my resistance. Get your body is nice, like fire in the distance. Bring your body closer, let there be no distance. Look what you started, take my resistance home. Huh? Take my resistance home. Huh? My resistance, oh, oh, oh. like fire in the distance, oh, oh. like fire in the distance. Oh, oh. This is so oh my goodness. Okay, so we're here. What do we start? Um, I think we start with um, some drinks mm -hmm. and then the dance floor. Oh, sounds like a plan. Oh my god! It's just so beautiful. I know, right? Bye bye. Hey, what are you drinking? Hold on, hold on. Who do I see? Wait, wait, hey! Wait, wait, wait. Just leave me now. Just leave me. Calm down. Wait, wait, look. No, Tony lied to me. Let me go and confront no. him. No, no, you don't do that. He doesn't know you're here. That's the edge you have over him, okay? That way you get to see what he's up to. You're right. Hey, why aren't you outraged? I mean, if Tony is here, it means the other guys probably will be here too. Oh, no. <laughs> no Ricky will do that. Yeah. Again, yeah. Ricky will never ever like that. <laughs> oh, James is a man full of integrity. Yeah. Very responsible. Integrity. Man. Honest man. Mm -hmm. Can't do but, <gasps> Tony. And lights, apparently. Burning in the distance. Take my resistance. It's James. Who's that? Is that not James? Mm -hmm. Hey, 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 you must listen to your own advice. Oh. You're not confronting them. Okay? Oh, That's Ricky. Integrity. And these are the patients. <laughs> Ricky likes me. This is a hospital. They know. Like fire in the distance. Ah, <laughs> oh, Look at that body, go, body, go. Now, this is what I think. We all go back to the room before them. And we don't ask them of anything because we didn't say anything. Mm -hmm. Do I have time? I will even be sleeping before I get to the room. I, mean, I won't talk to him. I don't have such time. I just want to see the look on his face when I ask. God. You don't <sighs> ask him. Fine. Deal? Deal. How is Sly? Sly? What, what happened to Sly? Oh, Sly! Sly! <laughs> Sly's good, okay? He's fine. He's alive. The doctor says he'll be back tomorrow. Everything's fine. Fine indeed. So, 
So, you had a boring night? Yeah, nothing much. Uh, sick people, hospitals, nothing much. And liars too. Lying is a sickness, you know. Why didn't you tell me you guys were going for a party? And I still don't believe how you guys followed us there. We didn't follow you guys. We only went there on our own and we happened to find you there. Oh, okay. So you went there without telling me yourself. Huh? Huh? Uh, I'm not just in the mood for this argument right now. You brought it up. I'm just going to sleep. Sleep. Liar! <laughs> ah, nice dreams. This is probably going to the request the movie. Oh, right. <laughs> James. <laughs> What movie are we seeing? You see, are you serious, James? Is this what I think it is? What's that? It's one of my movies. Yeah, it's actually a movie with you and Linda. Amazing. Oh my gosh, it's temptations. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've seen this one. Oh, please. You haven't watched like 99% of my movies. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're starting with this one. It's about... Madame so... Actress. Don't be a spoiler. <laughs> Sorry. I hope you're going to give me a sweet treat in bed tonight. Well, depends on how much you put on the table. She didn't even answer the question. Hey, James, are you sure this movie is friendly? Very friendly, my brother. Yeah, I mean, I mean it's fine. It's, I mean, it just shows how good, you know, it's very real. Like, they're very professional, like, you know. Linda's very good. Were you too naked? I like to never tell You have to tell this one time. No, we weren't. Um, we were in pants. <laughs> so, is this real? Wait, are you sure you guys are okay with this? Oh yeah. I mean, what can we do? Yeah, I mean, you know, what can we do is, I mean, it's just, it's just work, you know, it's, you know, it's just, it's just so professional. It shows, you know, Linda's a really good actress. I and mean, Vicky, you know, yeah, you're really doing, doing good. It's, yeah, I agree. It also Aww. shows how good Vicky is. Mm -hmm. Thank you, baby. Well, good or not, I don't think I'll have my Irene do this. You don't let your Irene do anything, so there's no surprise here. I think I've found a new career. Kissing. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is actually a very good film. Oh yes, this movie is indeed amazing. Especially with the sex scenes. Yeah, the sex scenes. <laughs> <laughs> Shall we watch another one? No, 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 no. no. it's fine. Thank you. Another of his movies? No. No, no, no. no. Are you sure? No. Yeah. I'm mean, going to pay for it. No, no, I think, no, it's, it's... <laughs> well, that was fun. I'm glad you enjoyed the movie. What the hell is that? What's going on? What's going on? You had your mouth in another man's mouth. You're practically a married woman. I beg, please. You know, that is that's part of the job. What's wrong with you? I know that you act, all right? Not pornography. What? You're practically naked. It's part of my job. 
What, what nonsense job is that? What? You know, I can't believe you're having this fight. I'm sure Ivy understands that Ricky had to do what he had to do. I don't understand why you call it act when it's just prostitution. It's just a movie. She is practically a married woman. Oh, so you would have been fine if she was single. That's not the point. My point is, why do you keep accepting all those roles? Ricky, you are not a struggling actor. There are some roles you should say no to and you won't die. It's not about the money. So acting on screen naked is now your passion, Abby? Acting is my passion. And if that involves me going naked on screen, then so be it. So what, what do you want me to do? You want me to quit my job? No. I don't want to quit your job. I want you to fill the kind of role that you get. Okay, it's not every role that you want to act. Oh, you're right. <laughs> like you turn down some of the women that come, is it? What does that have to do with this? Tony, it means you stay out of my job and I stay out of yours. So are you telling me now that if you walked into the gym and saw me all naked and kissing with another woman all in the name of my job, you'd be okay with this? Mm -mm. First of all, I wasn't naked. And yes, I'm gonna be okay with that. You know, I'm gonna take a shower and go to bed. We're gonna do with two things at the same time. First the movie, now your life. Oh, my life. You know what, just, why are you going? Come here, Tony. My life, my life. Look, it's because they know you don't have a girlfriend. That's why they keep giving you all those kind of rules. How did we even arrive at this topic? I can't even deal with this anymore. No, 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 no. We need to talk about this. You want me to quit my job? I'm not saying that. All I'm saying is, I don't like you acting all those things. You keep hiding me. Why would they keep giving you all those kind of rules? They think you don't have a girlfriend. What? 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 You keep telling everybody that we're friends. Good morning, guys. Okay. Um, what happened last night? Okay. All right, guys. Are you ready for today's activities? Not in the mood, James. Please. What do you mean you are not in the mood? I've paid the instructor. Can we please stay in bed today? What is going on? Has it got anything to do with the movie? No. What activities were you talking about? Hey. Sly. What happened last night? Honorable. Oh, Do I look like a shrink? Okay, so it looks like some of you are a bit tense. So we're going to play a game called the dare game. No fines, no truth, just dare. All right, that's my cue. <clears throat> my brother, where are you going? Nothing in this world is do or die. Ah. Has it got to do with the movie you guys watched yesterday? Because if it wasn't that good, I wouldn't have played it. You said it had anything to do with the movie. Down. Your mood. I don't have any mood, okay? I was fine with the movie. I'm fine with the game. Let's go. All right, good. So the game is about... You know what? This is so childish. I'm out. See, I, I don't know anything. Anybody else want to leave? All right. Good. Raymond. Huh? I dare you to do 10 frog job. Really? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to be fun. Oh, yeah. Come on now. OK. <laughs> Reptile. One, One, two, two three. Mental Oh, Wait, 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 No, 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 he has to say rip it. Rip it, rip it. Huh? Love that. 
<sighs> Wait, guys, 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 please, I'll pay, I'll pay, I'll pay, I'll pay. I'll pay, I'll pay. Sit down. Oh, gosh, guys. Oh, my God. This is... This is... I, this is... I don't know what's more ridiculous. The fact that James is actually enjoying this. This is weird. Oh, get off me. Ah. Oh, my gosh. I hate you guys for this. <laughs> you hate them? I have to deal with your behind on my body. I don't know where your ass has been for the past 10 years. It was such a good feeling, baby. Sony. I dare you to act out a romantic scene with with, 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 with with Ivy. What? Yes. You guys should act as if um, you're in a romantic scene in a movie, kissing. I know what a romantic scene is. I just feel like it's inappropriate because my girlfriend is here. Oh, please. Don't use me as an excuse, okay? It's just a game. Just do what you got to do. I have no beef with it. My lady? I've loved you since the first day I met you. You're my pillar of strength and support. And I cannot picture future without you. So please, would you be my wife? Oh. Shut the hell up, Ray. Hold on one second, Mara. So is it that everyone here can act apart from me? This is not acting. They are not real actors. Hey, somebody there. Is there you are born? Uh, Ricky, where's he going? Angry birds. <laughs> well, where is he going to? They had to be in each other's shoes to understand. Okay. What was that? No! What was that? Oh, it doesn't feel good now, does it? Oh, wow. So this is some kind of revenge plan? Revenge? Did I plan the game? Well, look at you. You're gloating. <laughs> well, Linda, I'm actually doing something that you do to me, and now you're angry about it? Uh, 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 no. What I did was acting. What you did was simply rubbish. <laughs> Yeah, this is funny. This is funny, is it? It is hilarious. It is actually quite hypocritical. I'm trying to raise a point to you. Oh, will you stop saying that? Will you stop saying that for a second? Because you're not an actor. What's wrong? What's wrong with women like that? <laughs> Do you think they'll be okay? Or did I really do something bad? Yes. Yes to what? Both. Oh, no. 
I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I think you were very objective in whatever things you were saying. And because of what you said, they now see things from each other's point of view. Oh, thank God. <sighs> Don't look. Stella is coming. Who's Stella? The model I've been eyeing. Please excuse us for 10 minutes. What? Please just excuse us for 10 minutes. And the room too. Get down. Get down. Get down. <clears throat> hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> oh, please have a seat. Thank you. You look beautiful. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm good. I was just about to call you. Really? That is a beautiful day to swim. Are you done? Yeah, let's go. Can I join you? So, that was something else. Yeah, what a game. Do you think they are right? What? The argument, do you think isn't making any sense? That what they did was similar to what we did. Look, Ricky, we are acting Does it really matter? They were acting too. The only difference was the absence of a camera. Yet, it still hurts. <laughs> so what? We're supposed to reject all kissing rules? No. I am not saying that. So? But now I know how it hurts. I feel there's something we can do better. I guess it's nice. You ordered more food? No. Can you please check? Tell us at the door. Huh? You invited her. Can you please excuse us again? I beg. You for like two hours, three hours, please. When I come in, just call me and knock. If you knock twice and I don't respond, I'm busy. Please. I beg you, I beg you. Thank you. expecting you. I hope I didn't interrupt. Never, my sister. N-E-V-E-R. Never. Have a seat. <laughs> wow. 
What a beauty. I ordered food for you. Right, I can see that. And your favorite wine. Mm-hmm. Ah, God. <laughs> oh my God. You are a full-blown robber. But it was just a drink. I'm thirsty. This is something you could have paid for. But why are you they bore? Because I am tired. If you came here to rob the whole place, then you need to leave. Oh, so now you think you're better than me. I am trying to change. I am trying to make things right. Don't worry. When you come out of that, your small heaven, you will come crawling right back to me. Benita, you know what? Take this and leave. I don't want to see you when I get back, and I mean it. Hey. something wrong? No. Uh -huh. That reminds me. Where is the girl you came here with? Uh, Benita, is that her name? Yes, that's her name. I haven't seen her around lately. And you won't. She just left. Why? Well, conflicting factors. Boss. Two shots of vodka plus Sprite. Right. So where's James? I don't know. Oh. Did something happen? It's just... It's complicated. Hey, listen. I know James. James is my friend, okay? James is a cool guy. If there is something bothering you, I think you need to speak to him, okay? It's so complicated that I don't even know how to talk about it. Well, then that's serious. Yeah. Well, nothing is that complicated, you know. Of course, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, really? So how do I explain the fact that I am not James' girlfriend, but just a taxi driver he paid to pretend to be his girlfriend? Little did I know that the pay came along with being embarrassed in front of these younger models. Well, I would explain that you have had enough to drink. But that's the truth. <laughs> oh no. And I just told you the embarrassing truth. That I'm a taxi driver. You think that is embarrassing? You make an honest living. There's nothing embarrassing about it. Oh come on, that's easy for you to say. I'm sure you're some big shot with some big company whose salary can pay... I am a thief. <laughs> so, I heard you live in Dubai. Wow. Word really travels far. Yeah. <laughs> but I've not been there, you know? Really? Yeah. I mean, it's not that far. We can go sometime. Really? Yes. Oh, that would be so great. <laughs> oh. Wow, I must be that boring. Oh, no, I'm sorry. It's just my mom. Is everything okay? 
Not really, you know. She's been admitted in the hospital. So we're just trying to gather money for her release. That's all. Yeah, but I thought you just finished the fashion show. Yeah, but you know they don't pay much. You know that. <sighs> okay, let me see what I can do. Really? Okay. <clears throat> Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you. This 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 will go a long way. Thank you so much. No, Come here. <laughs> it's fine. What's wrong? No, I just had a long day, so I'm fine. You had a long day. Yeah, I'm tired. Oh. Okay. Then I'll come here tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. All right. Thank you. You're not gonna see me tomorrow. And this is how I went from being a con man to an amp robber. I don't think this is the right place for you to be discussing this. I don't care. I don't care anymore. I have failed. I mean, look at my friends. They are here with leaders they are proud of and jobs that are legit. Then look at me. It's not too late to start all over. Where do I start from? I don't know. A legitimate business? If I had any idea of any legitimate business, I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing. I mean, what I used to do. I don't know, but um, if you're serious about this, I think maybe we can do something together. What? Well, I'm planning to start up um, a delivery service. Really? Yeah. Although I want to start off with delivering food, we will later expand to delivering other things. And you think it's a profitable service? Papa, ha. I have a friend who does the same thing. And yes, they're making money, especially for the owners. Oh, good. Yeah. Good. But you know what? There's, there's something these owners have that we are lacking. What? Kudi, money. Don't worry about that. I carry my business plan everywhere I go. <laughs> you have a business plan. <laughs> this is something serious. <laughs> yes, it is. I'm not joking. Wow. And, uh, wait, do you have anybody in mind? Someone we can show the business plan to? I had someone in mind, but... I don't know anymore. Okay, well, don't worry. We'll find someone. Cheers. Partners.
Hey. What's going on? Yeah, I did. Um, I've been trying to reach Annie for some time now, but her phone is off. Oh, yes, her phone is off. Um, long story. But she's okay. She did with me, Seth. With you? Yes, she spent the night here. Hey, not like that. So, like how? Well, we were at the bar last night. We had a little more to drink. And she spent the night here. Hey, but nothing happened, okay? Even if something happened, it will not be bad news. She'll not be a woman safe. <laughs> is, is that what she told you? All right, can you just tell her that um, next time she wants you to do something like that, she should just give me a heads up. No, she can't want to do this. This. Uh, James, he's not too happy you spend the night here. I thought he would rather be happy that I left the room for him and his new friend. Um, I think it's more of the fact that he didn't know your whereabouts, so he was worried. Yeah. He's right. Um, I should have told him. Uh, well, I'm sure you'll get over it. Uh, listen, I... I was thinking about what you said last night about the delivery service. I told you about that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, man. I don't think I should be drinking anymore. Yeah. But I think it's a great idea, and I will really, really like to be a part of it. If you let me. Why won't I? Well, because yesterday I told you that I'm a... You know what? I don't think you remember, so I wouldn't bring it up. I'm starting to remember. <laughs> and yes, I do remember that you told me you were a con man. I'd still like to do business with you. Like you said, you were a con man. I was thinking about something yesterday, but I held it to myself because I thought you were drunk. I don't know how to say this, but yesterday I felt something different. I want you to be my girlfriend. I know we only know each other the last night and I love you. I've never felt the way I felt last night and it's special, right? Hi. 
Crazy, crazy, crazy love in this uh. Crazy, 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 crazy. I thought it was supposed to be a buffet. It's a buffet. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Meet my girlfriend, Annie. Wait, what's happening here? You mean between this morning and now? You guys are an item? Technically, no. Um, we both like each other and we want to date. <laughs> Isn't that exciting? Talk to you outside for a minute. <laughs> so, so Raymond, you actually stole someone's girlfriend, like Raymond. James, what the hell is going on? With what? Raymond, Annie. Okay, let me tell you what happened, okay? I was stranded at the airport, and Annie's the one who helped me, okay? With transportation and everything. And in return, I just asked her to accompany me to the resort and pretend to be my girlfriend, and I'll give her something. So, let me understand this. Are you saying she's on contract? <laughs> something like that. James. Wait, 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 let me get this straight. So you paid her to escort you is she a prostitute? No, she's a taxi driver. A taxi driver? Eh, um, we've been friends for over 30 years. 35 years? Yes, 35 years, to be precise. And if there's an issue like this, don't you think it's good enough to give us a heads up? Exactly. As your friends? Instead of us coming all the way here to look like idiots and donkeys in front of our wives and girlfriends? Yeah. You, you, you agree to that, right? Yes. I'm sorry. You have to add money. Hey, I'm sorry, but have you finished? So wait, wait. Should, should we take Raymond out? Yes, should we? Uh, yeah. Leave him. Uh, leave him. Leave him. But that's very bad. That's very bad. Yeah. You, that's disrespect to the friendship. Are you trying to drown me? Why would you say that? I mean, we're standing close to a river, and you know I can't swim. And you're angry with me. Why would I be angry with you? For yesterday. Look, Tony and I Why would I be angry with you? When you did exactly what I normally do and expect you not to be angry. Huh. Ricky, is this a trick or something? Ivy, you've been right all this time. You've been right. You have every right to be annoyed with me for not claiming you well as my girlfriend when really I was so much in love with you. You're right. But the roles I played, I, I couldn't see because I was in my shoes. But yesterday I stepped in your shoes and I saw it all. Look, Ivy, I am sorry for everything. I promise not to take on rules that will insult you anymore. I promise not to belittle to you like I do anymore. I promise to spend the rest of my days with you to make you happy. Oh my God, Ricky. <laughs> I don't have a ring now. But I promise to make you happy for the rest of my days. If only you'll be my wife. Ricky. Will you marry me? 
Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. I love you. Raymond, so if she's your new girlfriend now, what happened to the one you came with? Please. That story is for another day, I beg you. You haven't said a word to me since yesterday. A man, a few words. Oh, yeah. And the first words that came out of your mouth were lies. Why are you going? Say a few words to you, right? You want to hear a few words? I'll tell you a few words, but not in front of my friends, okay? You what said I should talk, so let me. Okay. I think it's highly hypocritical of you to talk about the girls at the gym. When I talk about what you do, you say I just work. It's already playing. Tony, it's not. I also think it's highly hypocritical of you to pretend like what happened between Ivy and I is not the same with what happened to you and Wally. But there you go around condemning us. But when I talk about you, you said I should deal with this. It's not. The... So don't, 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 don't come at me with this, with this fake anger because there you go around taking my annoyance for granted. I'm done. You can talk. I agree. I'm sorry, what? Jesus Christ. Tony, I said I agree with whatever you're saying. You're right. I haven't been taking my roles into consideration. But look, you're my man. And I don't want you to do something that makes me feel uncomfortable. Same, I don't want to do something that makes you feel uncomfortable. We are partners, like it or not. We can't just sit around and act like our decisions doesn't affect each other, because it does. Look, I'm sorry. Okay? I'm sorry, who are you and what have you done with the real Linda? Oh my goodness, don't start with me. Really? I just said I'm sorry. Sorry too, baby. Come here. I love you. I love you too. Baby, can you see a little love a little? No, I wouldn't do that. Can you see a little love? Lose that face. Yes, ma'am. No, no, don't do that. No, don't, no, no. don't do that. Yes, yes. Very well, nice, sir. Okay. So that will be tomorrow. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Bye bye. Ah. <sighs> Who was that? Work matter. Nothing for you to worry yourself about. You're right. What do I know about work? Oh, Odo. What I was actually doing was for you, you know. For me? Yeah. How? I'm trying to get you something. Let me guess. A cat? No, silly. <laughs> A salon. Huh? Uh, you know, you've been saying you want to go back to work. So I decided to contact one of my guys to see if he could purchase you the new place, and he did. So, the documents are in your name. No, I can't believe this. Yes, you have to. Are you... Yes, yes, yes! Hey, so back. Thank you so much. Thank it's you. Okay. You're welcome. I love you. Maybe too much. That's why I tried to keep you at home. So that I could do all the work so you don't have to lift a finger. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't own you. You're not a piece of property. So whatever you decide to do, I'm going to be in full support of it. I love you! <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> I love you so much. Yeah, but calm down. The sound is not yet. Stop. Oh, I'm so yeah. excited! I'm <laughs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! What? Wait, am I missing something? Oh, um, yeah, the ring is not there yet, but who cares? I'm no engaged! Way. I'm engaged! Oh, <laughs> nice! Oh my goodness!
Yes. You gotta be kidding me. I'm not kidding you. Congratulations, man. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yes! You did not say a word. Oh, you know, right? <laughs> Very expensive ring. No yeah. <laughs> so I just want to thank each and every one of you for spending the weekend together. Um, some of us fought, some of us made up, and some of us actually got engaged. So congratulations to Ricky and Ivy. And this time around, I hope it's not going to take another 10 years for us to do this reunion again. And whose fault was that? I know. It's my fault. We are hoping that the next reunion will be at your wedding. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so congratulations again and God bless us all. Nice to meet you. Hey. Okay. Bro. Bro. Wait, wait. Where's, where's my missus? We are going together, no hugs. Thanks for the salon. Yeah. Hey. Hey. So um you're leaving in Raymond? Yeah. Um I want to flesh out the details of our business. You're starting a business together? Something like that. Wow. I know. Well, um, I want to say a very big thank you for everything. Thank you for bringing me along with you. Even when I was being so annoying. You couldn't even be annoying even if you tried to. <laughs> well, um, I came to say thank you. Well, I want to say sorry for everything. Sorry for what? I just came to thank you for the best weekend of my life. I mean, sorry for bringing you all the way here, treating you badly and just allowing you to go. But if you need any help, you and Raymond, with the business or anything, just let me know. I'll be there to support. Really? I've been wanting to tell you about my business proposal from the first day I met you. Um. I'll send you an email and you can go through it and tell me what you think about it. I'm sure I'm very much interested. I mean, you're a smart young woman and I know you have the brains. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm supposed to be leaving with Raymond, but um, I asked him to take the lead so that um, I accord you that respect. Since you brought me here, I'd want you to drop me at home yourself. Do you still like the front or the back seat? Back. The back. <laughs> After you. Anyway.